So I got this uh, Hewlett Packard access point. It's defective and let's have a look inside. Okay, it looks like antennas. Let's unscrew it. Oh, and uh, the case looks uh, to ma be made out of cast aluminium, and the front is of course plastic, because antennas. So let's take this off. Okay. Mm -hmm. If you can see it, every antenna has a ground <coughs> plane below it. And is connected with a cable to two radio modules. So let's unhook these clips. Okay, so let's dig a little bit deeper and remove this panel. Okay, it doesn't come out. No. Uh, maybe I have to remove the modules first. Maybe there are screws below them. No screw or no. This one? Mm, no screw as well. Maybe here? No. No. So. Hmm. There are no screws here. Ah, a little bit more for us. Is necessary. Ah, here we go. Okay. That looks like heat conductive conductive beds. Uh, they are connecting the radios and this case here is presumably the main processor of this access point. Let's see if I can find uh, what's wrong with these modules. The capacitors look intact, so maybe not the uh, power. So, I guess this concludes the, the add on. No, no, maybe let's have a look inside there.
This is a bit sticky, so maybe there is a thermal bed below this as well. It's not easy to get it off. Yeah, I guess it, it will conclude that they are done now. Thanks for watching and goodbye. Okay, not goodbye. I managed to pull it off. So what we've got here. That looks like a Freescale processor. I have no idea what it is and I guess I'm not investigating it any furthermore. So this looks like a JTAG interface for something on here. But for now, thanks for watching and goodbye.